John Coast Mace R&D. Well, we're taking a little break here from racing the Fiat, lots of laughs, and what we're going to do today is we're going to take a look at a Porsche 911 cylinder head that we have to change some valve guides in and do a valve job on. I want to show you how we remove the valve guides here at Coast Mace R&D because there is kind of a trick to it. You can take and just knock the things out with a uh, drift and a hammer, but that's really not quite the way to go about it because sometimes the guides will actually take and mushroom out and then they'll make the hole oversized that they were in. So we're going to take a look here and see how we do it. I'm going to look at this cylinder head. And as you can see, it has the valve guide still in there. And what we do is we actually core drill the valve guide so that we can knock the thing out. By core drilling, it makes this section here real thin and thereby reducing the amount of pressure that's on the guide so it knocks out pretty easy. So we'll get started. I'm going to start by installing the head on a cam tower that we have set up in the seat and guide machine. And we've already adjusted this for the correct angle. So I just need to tighten down to one side because all the pressure is going to be down on the back side. So this is our core drill. We'll get this lined up. start to cut it. I only drill down so far so that I have a step in the bottom so that I can knock the guide out. And what we'll be using is a valve guide driver like this to go down through and knock the guide out. So let's take a look and see how that's done. And there we have it. For more information about Porsche cylinder head rebuilding, call John Edwards at Costa Mesa R&D. Talk to you soon.